What's up, y'all? Welcome to August with the Shade. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. And listen, make sure you leave your comments down below because you know I love to read my comments from the motherfucking subscribers, period. And also, guys, we have our memberships popping right now. So if you want to join the membership, make sure you join us with the link below. Now, listen. I already told y'all that I'ma drag a couple of Nikki Ops every week. Now, this person here is no exception. I really don't give a F if he knew her half of her life, okay? I don't care because what he did was he tried to tarnish her name and he tried to take her down along with his downfall, okay? So, the person that I'm talking about is Safari. Now, it looks like right now Safari is in the news because he cheated on his wife with some stripper, some girl, some model, who knows, you know what I'm saying? Safari is a known womanizer, and I don't even understand how he's a womanizer when he's so effing corny. Like, this dude is so fucking corny. I really can't even believe that Nicki Minaj actually seen something in him. Like, so I know he has some type of, you know, positive energy around him. We already know he's not a good rapper. We know he's lame, but we do know he got a big, uh, okay? So we just gonna leave it at that. But listen, that's his thing. Listen, whatever he got going on with his wife, I feel like, once again, it is pouring into the media, and he is going to have to respond. But how many times are you gonna respond to cheating on somebody that you were with for a long time? Now, him and Erica Mena has not been, been, you know, with each other for long. I feel like their relationship is really all on the ends of Nicki Minaj being happy with Kenneth Petty, and he felt like he needed to have somebody next to him, you know, hence the why they got a baby, and another baby coming. You know what I'm saying? Like, He's like, oh, I have to outdo her every time. Like, that's how I feel about Nicki Minaj's ops. Like, I always feel like they're trying to one up on her. I never feel like they're ever being happy in their real life because they're so fucking miserable. You understand what I'm saying? When you're miserable like that, they do things like that. When you do things out of evil intent, you end up like them. Like, y'all are getting a divorce for like the third time since y'all been married. Like, who gives a fuck? Like, who cares about Safari? Safari needs to go and try to write another hit for another female rapper since he wrote all of those hits for Nicki, right? Right? And then what he said, you said you wrote all her songs. Look at you pandering, scraping the ground. You're on Love and Hip Hop. You're on all of these stupid shows that you would have never been on if you were still with Nicki Minaj. But eat your words. Go actually go actually write some new words for a new female rapper. And let's see if actually that you were telling the truth. Because you can't even write a bar for yourself, let alone write a bar for the woman that you're married to that claims to be an aspiring singer. <laughs> Let's sip on that, okay? I don't even like Erica Mena. Erica Mena is a known Nicki Minaj hater, and she's also Little Kim's friend, so she chooses to go around and use disrespectful slander against Nicki Minaj, so F her and her bone face, okay? Stay off the drugs, Mena. Stay off the drugs, baby, okay? All right, and Safari, you know we really don't like you. We know that you are a straight-up cornball. Nobody ever really likes you, okay? I'm pretty sure every time Nicki brings you around, they always ask, who is the gay guy? Who is the gay guy is the question that they all want to know. Okay, keep twerking, keep doing what you do, find a new woman and be happy. Stop trying to do things to get, you know, to get back in Nicki Minaj because it's not even making you happy in the inside. You know what I'm saying? So that's my thought. That's my take on that. I hope that they get a divorce and I hope that they go their separate ways. That's just my opinion. Listen, make sure y'all leave your comments down below. Listen, and also make sure y'all join the memberships because y'all know we be getting into some things on the membership. Now we have members only live where we kiki with just us. Okay, so make sure y'all throw them palm trees in the chat and thank y'all so much for helping us reach 2K. And listen, we on the road to more. So listen, shout out to everybody that has supported this channel. We love y'all from the bottom of our heart. We out.